Good morning and welcome to the month of October 2021. God is faithful, preserved us to see January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October. Are you glad to see this month? Let's lift up our hands and give glory to our Father. Heavenly Father, we are so grateful in Jesus' precious name. So that the month of October will not go like any other month for you, it is important to know what the Lord is saying about this month and to run with the prophetic word for the month of October. The scripture speaking in 1 Timothy chapter 1, verse 18 says, This charge I commit unto thee, son Timothy, according to the prophecies which went before on thee, that thou by them mightest war a good warfare. Every prophecy you don't walk war with, you never see the manifestation of it. So, very important, take the prophetic word, war with it every day remind god this is what you said about this prophetic word this month of october and i receive it and run with it in jesus name now god dwells in heaven and his footstool is on the earth isaiah chapter 66 verse 1 he sits upon the circle of the earth watching over its affairs isaiah chapter 40 verse 22 god intervenes in the affairs of men through angelic hosts and that is why he's called the God of Sabbath, God of the angel Amis. The angel of the Lord comes around the saints of God and delivers them. Psalm 34 verse 7. At a time when the king of Syria was incensed against Elisha, he sent a host with chariots and horses to surround him. However, even without Elisha praying, God sent a host with chariots of fire and horses of fire. To surround him. His only prayer to God was to open the eyes of his servants to see the hosts and the horses and chariots on fire, which God did. Second Kings chapter 6, verse 17. Elijah was taken to heaven by chariots of fire and horses on fire. Second Kings chapter 2 and verse 2. The chariots of God are 20,000, even thousands of angels. The Lord is among them as in Sinai. In the holy places, Psalm 68 and verse 17. God gives his angels charge over us to keep us in all our ways, Psalm 91 verse 11. The children of Israel were surrounded in the wilderness by the pillar of cloud by day and the pillar of fire by night, Exodus chapter 13 verses 21 and 22. Jesus, speaking at the time of his arrest, said, Don't you realize I could ask my father, for thousands of angels to protect us, and he will send them instantly. Matthew chapter 26, verse 53, New Living Translation. Consequently, every child of God is too surrounded to be attacked, too defended to be offended, and too protected to be molested by the camp of the wicked. That is why the scriptures say, The rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the lots of the righteous lest the righteous put forth their hands into iniquity. Psalm 125 and verse 3. It is important to note that the same fire that protects and purifies God's children is the same fire that wards off and destroys the enemy. Malachi chapter 3 and verse 3. Deuteronomy chapter 9 and verse 3. Based on the foregoing, the prophetic direction for October 2021 is... I am surrounded by fire. Shout out loud. I am surrounded by fire. Zechariah chapter 2 verse 5 says, For I, say the Lord, will be unto her a wall of fire round about and will be the glory in the midst of her. All through the month of October, we shall explore God's protection covenant and his means of protection through the horses on fire and chariots on fire. May the fire of the Lord preserve and purify you all through the month of October and beyond in Jesus' precious name. So what do you do? Rise up. Take this word of prophecy everywhere you go, every day, in the morning, in the afternoon, and the night. Remind the Lord, you said, I am surrounded by fire. My entire household is surrounded by fire. My job is surrounded by fire. My marriage is surrounded by fire. And declare this every day over your life and watch what God will do. Rise up 
The prophecy you don't war with never comes to pass in your life. So rise up, begin to war with this prophecy and see the manifestation, manifestation of God. God bless you. Have a beautiful month ahead of you. Jesus is Lord.